Welcome back everybody, it's time to lock down Arena, and I know I've been slacking a little bit with the daily uploads this week, missed Monday, missed yesterday, uh, but I'm trying to get back on schedule, been pretty busy with some family stuff, trying to set up new cars and new purchases, lots of expenses lately in the past few days, uh, so just haven't been able to record, but, and I've been like playing Call of Duty a lot too, and that's been using up all my time, so stay tuned for some cool games coming up for that. But we're going to jump into another traditional ranked. We went up against, is it Phoenix on Tuesday? Uh, we played all right. I made a critical error on game two that lost us the game. So we're 0-1 right now with the mono blue merfolk. Let's see if we can do better this time. We'll play first. Uh, we'll keep this. Let's see what we're up against here. Samurai, what you got for us? Okay, going against Is It Phoenix again? Uh, so we're going to take the opportunity to play River Sneak. Start getting uh, some pumps on him. Okay, so not Is It. Some kind of ma a mass type thing. It's a good thing we got our unblockables going. Uh, so let's drop our silver gill. Get a card draw going. And, oh, that's a good draw. I can dig it. That'll be coming down next turn. Might have actually been more beneficial to maybe hold off on Mystical Herald. Uh, drop Deep Root next turn along with Mystical Herald. That way we can get the triggers on that. Uh, but this is okay. We're free to swing in here for quite a bit because they're definitely not going to block with their mass if they do. Well, yeah, I guess they can. They can just refill it next turn. So not a big deal. We'll just keep their a mass counter on the on the lowest count it can be. No removal yet. So I'm not exactly thrilled. The water trap the mass. Not really necessary yet at this point, but I want to start getting triggers on these things. All right, taking out that guy, not a big deal. We're still gonna be building our army. We do need some more card draw, though. Ooh, goes to two. I'm assuming they just got a bunch of a mass and removal, but they still got six cards in hand and we're starting to flood out here. So not ideal. Oh, okay. So it's the bolus deck. Uh-oh. Well, we'll get rid of the island. No big deal. Silver gill for full value. And a benthic. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What am I doing here? Uh... It's tempting just to go for the face here, but I don't want Nicol Bolas to start getting out of control, so I think we need to attack into him. Come on. I'm massing again. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Owie. Nice. That hurts. That hurts a lot. Alright, well, let's do this and adapt. We'll still keep getting our board going. Deep root water's coming in clutch for refilling our board. Trickster's good. Uh, we'll get rid of the island. Pass to them. We'll tap it down. Get the trigger. We're presenting lethal, so they gotta have some removal here. Another board wipe. Cross my fingers. No board wipe. Okay, Kefnet. Okay, buddy. Oof. Well, that's... That's a really good pull. We need these card draws. So everything's gonna start having card draws going. We're gonna freely attack in here. They can trade with something. I don't care. We need to get some card draws. Refill our hand. 
Benthic is fine. I'm not looking to adapt him any further. Bring him to three. Have a good board. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. The bean. Mm, we're gonna... We're gonna drop Mist Cloak. And continue to establish our board because we need to fight through here till the end. We're gonna have to chump block. Take four. Okay. Goodbye, Miss Cloak Herald. So, goodbye, two things because they just copied it. Alright, no more C4, Oracle. Girl. Or coal. They have the mana for it? Yeah, they got another Veraska's attempt. Um, alright, so... We could take the seven. We're gonna... We're gonna take the seven here. Oh, what? When did this get lifelink? Oh, six or greater. Frick. Forgot about that. Well, it's not good. They just turned it around. I forgot this thing gains lifelink if it's six or greater. Well, we, we didn't really have a way to deal with that. So, oh, oh, I needed to attack first. Frick. Alright, that's fine. Another deep root. And now they got Liliana. I think they turned it around here. It's not looking good for us anymore. They're about to gain eight life this turn. Okay. Complete control on the board for them. Kefnet really did them good. Sacrifice creature. Boom. Don't even have enough to take him out. Oh, we do. We do. But we'll lose our entire board. What needs to happen here? Just block one. Back to 18 they go. Not pretty. Not pretty. Putrid, but effective. They still got two removals in their hand. Okay, well. Go Silvergill. Full retail again. I would have liked to play Deep Root Water into something else, but... Okay. And we got an extra trigger from Nabeen. <sighs> mm, I don't know why they're scared to attack in with the god. I'm just going to try to keep Liliana away from her final... Alright, they, real they realized what Nabeen was doing for me. Just gave me two card draws. Mmm, <laughs> I'm gonna let this go one more turn, but, uh, pretty sure we're all but done here. We'll just go to game two. We almost were able to close it out. Forgot about that lifelink, but, again, we, we couldn't really do much about it. go like this. D 
don't know why they're not attacking it with Kefnet. Even if we have a Trickster, we can't really kill it here. I'm sacrifice two creatures. Each player, though. Okay, well. Let's run it like that. He goes third from the top. No, nope, they let him go to the graveyard. Ah, that's because they had another one in hand. Yeah, we'll go to game two. Not a great way to start. Okay, what's going to be good here? Kazmina. Negate looks good. Transmutation. We'll take out Chart, of course. We'll take out Oracle. I think the Deeper Waters needs to stay. Hmm. Let's do... Let's take out two Nabeans. And... We'll take out two Mist Cloaks. We'll run it like that. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. This is... an interesting hand. I think we're gonna keep... We can start building our board with Deep Root. We just need to pull another Merfolk to get a card draw Silvergill. And we have the Kazminas as well. So Kasmina's transmutation should work really get good against the Amass because it's going to continue to be the army, but it's only going to remain a 1-1 one, one and lose all of its abilities. So I think we'll hold that in our hand until we absolutely need to use it in case they start amassing to 6, then we'll just Kasmina's transmutation on it. Exactly necessary. Go ahead and take out my creature right away. And this doesn't hit enchantment, so deep root safe and Kazmina safe. Body erasure, yep, it'll resolve. Bye bye, Kazmina. My assumption. No, took out the other deep root. All right, they're concerned about my ward going off. Pass to them. So they brought in the hand hate against us, I'm assuming. I don't know if this is in their main board. Potentially might have to use the Transmutation on the Kefna. Hmm, okay. We'll water trap Weaver it for a couple turns and make sure they don't have any other crazy threats. A turn, I should say. Looking to 
to take something out here. Alright. And there's the mass coming down. They don't have the enchantment out, so we're just dealing with a 4 4 creature. What is the bigger threat here? I feel like Kefnet is the bigger threat, so I think we'll go ahead and do this now. While they're tapped out, uh, we'll just pass the turn. Okay, now they got it. Lovely. So... We need another transmutation, pretty much. If they attack in with uh, this guy, I might... I might just trade my board for it, leave the river sneak up. Not sure if that's exactly wise, but... Well, now it doesn't matter. That's pretty much game. We don't have any cards. Silvergill Adept, full value. Man, oh man. Yeah, that's gnarly. Uh, there's nothing we can really do here about this. Kazmina is not going to help us here, really. And Kasmina's good, so we are good. Thank you. I'm fine. I'm good. <laughs> this is a rough start to our entrance into traditional with mono blue merfolk. Um, might have to look at seeing what else we might be able to do here, but hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing some Amass gameplay coming in hot with that Bolas and Liliana. Pretty cool. Uh, I do like the Amass decks. They are uh, they got some nice combos, that's for sure, and they were able to pull theirs off pretty easily. Uh, we weren't able to really hold them down for as long as we needed to, but hopefully you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned. We'll be back again tomorrow, and we will see you guys in the next video.